guys, Cheap here with more Grey Fox. Sorry about the little delay at the ending there. For some reason, my binding's not working for ending the episode. Which happens from time to time. Okay, I want grapes. What if I guess should get that? Yeah, let's do it. Can I pay for these grapes? Duh! Five dollars. Thanks. Yeah. If I get the chance, I'm gonna kick him so hard in the face. Which, to be honest, I think is actually nice of me because, you know, I can kick him in other places, but I'm gonna settle for the face. I brought you some grapes. Finally. Here's a little something. Hey, I got a hundred bucks. Oh my god, thank you. Oh wait, let me see that. Return hundred dollars. I meant this one. Got ten dollars. Thanks. Jerk. Um. I guess we'll go back to the pub. Is there something for me to do here? Let me talk to this lady again. So, do you think I'm just like everyone else? Bitter, alone, cruel. I honestly doubt that. What if you could live one day of their stupid lives? Why would I want to do that? You could choose their fate. Think of the possibilities. What, like play God? Think about it. The mysterious lady has disappeared. That was very mysterious. Yay! I was really having fun. Oh, my cell phone! Hello! Uh, hi, Grey Fox incoming calling. One of those. My room available now. No rush, though. Okay, thank you. Yep. Alright, let's go finally have a place at the end. Oh, I wonder what room is gonna be. Hi, welcome back to Grey Fox Inn. So, you have a room now? Oh, yep, sure do. I only have the deluxe suite available. Is that okay? Yay! I paid for my room. Room's upstairs, okay? Got it. Thanks. Oh my gosh, it's the creepy person room. Are there goodies in here? Cushion ballroom seat. Wow, I'm really sleepy all of a sudden. Small flower with white or vase with white lilies. Scented mood candles. Hmm. Nice fresh laundries up there. It's a fiddly fig named for the violin shaped outline of its leathery deep green leaves. Why am I learning so much about plants? Bar which is full of refreshments. Celestial outlet. It's a stack of brochures. Looking for love? Meet local singles at the Grey Fox Pub. Okay, south of the jewelry shop. At Grey Fox Retirement Home, the caregivers care. Uh, am I reading all that? I might. Grey Fox are actually friendly neighborhood pharmacy. What we do for you, give you service with a smile, provide helpful advice, medical consultations, and reconciliation, diabetes clinic every month, prescription. Okay, so they just do things. Okay, death pressures. Anything in here? Oh, it's empty. Nah. Alright, let's go to sleep. Morning sleep will advance the story. I think we've done everything we can for the day. What? 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 You again? I am old. You should take a look at yourself in the mirror. Look at yourself in the mirror. Gasp! What? I'm old! Yes, yes you are. 
How does it feel? I'd be okay with it. It's interesting. Yes, many people find becoming old interesting. But what true but what's truly interesting is seeing the world through someone else's eyes. What do you mean? You can only see the world from your own eyes. Dude, we're in a room with like random fire and she's made us old and she's got a creepy looking mirror. Don't tell her that. Oh ho, you have no idea. Why don't you see for yourself? What's going on? Shh. I'm clearly a crazy cat lady given that, you know, thing behind there. Where am I? Do I still have- I still have my items. Oh, I have nice toilet paper. Screw you, I'm playing with the sink. Like porcelain teapot. Smelly hand towel. That's to say, the towel is smelly. It's not for smelly hands. Highly efficient washing machine, high tech dryer. Shelves full of knickknacks. Maple's diary is on the. Yes. She won December 16th. He's out with the men again. Probably come home late, stinking of booze. It's our wedding anniversary. Not sure why we celebrate it. Not like we had a wedding. There's a chemist in town. Says Marge. Says he makes special concoctions for a fair penny. Superman was out again. Didn't come home till after breakfast. Saw the chemist today. I feel a weight was being lifted off my shoulders. Not long now. He brought home flowers, my favorite too. Pink azaleas. Having second thoughts about my plan. Oh, snap! Mother's special teapot broke. Asked for some money to buy a new one. Not that it can be replaced. He said no. Guess beer fun is more important. I bought a new teapot. He was so upset he smashed on the kitchen floor just to spite me. That's it. I will do it. It's done. All of my troubles are over. Oh, snap. It's kitty clock. Face of Wilted Flowers. Beat it, Granny. Granny? I'm only 35. Pfft, nice try. They're talking and look like they don't want to be disturbed. I would like to talk to the person behind the cash register. Oh no, don't tell me your hubby broke another teapot. Her diary mentioned her husband broke this, her special teapot. No, thankfully. That's good. What was that? Probably stay out there. All right, fine. Kind of needs to keep off her ass, town of Gray Fox. All their jewelry is junk, if you ask me. Hello, honey. That ring you brought in sold. I was going to write you a check for your portion, but since you're here. Oh, thank you, but can you remind me which ring? Darling, are you serious? Okay, something is. Her face needs to be a little bit bigger, her neck thing needs to be thinner. That's weird. Your wedding ring. Oh, right, I remember now. Wow, she sold a wedding ring. I wonder where her husband. Her husband's dead, honey. Spend your money in all in one place, but if you must, spend it here. Display case is full of precious items ranging from adorable children bracelets to elegant and stunning engagement rings. Let's 
This place is full of elegant matching wedding band sets from somewhat simple to somewhat gaudy. This play case is full of men's jewelry, which is special occasion cufflinks, and classy high end wristwatches. 24 karat solid gold ring. Play it! Oh, jeez. I swear this is my their punishment to me. This Microsorium Musifolium crocodilis, or crocodile fern, is growing surprisingly well in the sh this shop without direct sunlight. Painting in Shook. Jewelry advertisement for a big company called LD, which really stands for Lucky Duck. What a quack. Some people buy plants to help against common interior emissions, such as ammonia, formaldehyde, carbon monoxide, benzene, xylene, and so on. This plant, however, was purchased because it looks pretty. It's a painting called La Rose de Dula. I messed that up. It's a massive diamond ring. It's like all diamond, no ring. Display cases. Dun 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 dun. I'll, I'm avoiding the pub for now. I feel like. Alright, nobody's out there. I don't recognize any of these names. Okay, that's good. <laughs> I haven't checked out this statue yet. Such is very impressive. Stands to represent the legendary gray fox for which this town was named after. Some say the gray fox was the spirit animal which guided native, guided native ancestors to the village back in the early days of the settlers. Some say the gray fox is purely fictional. However, the plaque simply reads gray fox. There's a dead man. That brat on the bicycle, he struck my husband. Please move along. That lady thinks it was me. Am I gonna go to jail? No. Oh good, thanks lady. Flu shot clinic today. Nah, I don't like needles. Me either. This man is getting some prescriptions, Phil. He's too busy to talk to you. Ross is too busy typing notion. Ahem. Yep, I'll be just a moment. What is wrong with your eyes? They are not big enough for your face. I'm so typing. Can I help you? No, I don't think so. I, I'm just here. Incontinent supplies. Magazines. Personal hygiene products, very important. Pain relievers, also very important. Diabetic meal replacement drinks. Please get out. Sorry, you should have shut the door. That that is entirely on you, sir. Have you been? I've been itching to ask you about it. This must be Agnes. What do you want now? Did you do it? No, of course not. No, not yet. No, nah, me neither. See, I'm wondering if they're killing their husbands or killing themselves. May I help you? Yes. Are you here to visit a patient? Yes? What's the patient's name? Uh... I've been playing a lot of WoW. I'm sorry ma'am, we don't have any patients by that name. We're busy talking. I'm fine.
Okay. I'm just exploring and having fun, to be honest. Someone died. Stack of computer hardware. Oh, that guy's not doing well. I don't know why I'm checking all this. Yeah, if I was the guy in the corner on life support and stuff, I'd probably be upset too. Oh, hi, Mabel. Okay, I guess my name is Mabel. Are you here to see your husband? Yeah! Okay. Dom has moved to the end of the hall. Do you remember how to get there? No, I mean, I can find it. Okay, it's up and then turn left and go straight. I think he's expecting you. Yeah, thanks. Now I'm going to the bar. Did I do it? He was over there being a grump. And, you know, kind of on life support and having blood exchanged and such. Hello? Hello? Uh, Mabel, you know Henry can't hear you. Oh, right. I knew that. Cough. How are you today? Can I get you a drink? No. Oh, okay. Well, tell Don we said hi. Whatever. I still got it. She's a desperate one. Hey, Mabel. Don't tell Agnes I'm here. Ew. A painting golden shower fall I ain't gotta leave there's a lot of jokes I can make here let's be honest it's the internet I have witnessed things there are many jokes I can make however I'm gonna be classy and just say I can make a joke if I wanted to why did I not coconuts down do I need coconuts There we go. <laughs> Mabel! Oh, hey! This is that one grumpy smoking guy. Hi, Don. Why have you come? To see how you're doing. Cough. You know damn well how I'm doing. You know, you were something, Mabel. I'm your faithful husband for 36 years, and this is the thanks I get. You poisoned me. I know it was you. Cough. I- What? Dawn? I wish I could have made you happy. I wish I could take back all the late night drinking with the fellas. I wish I could have given you children. I know it wasn't the wedding you had dreamed about. But I suppose- Cough. I suppose I can grant you this. You're free, Mabel. You're free. Cough. But know this. You only had to ask. I would have set you free ages ago. Dawn! It never had to end up like this. I know I never showed it, but I goddamn loved you. Cough. Dawn. I've been here for four weeks, Cough. Did you kind of make sure your work was done? Did you come here to watch me die? No, of course not! Closes his eyes and exhales his last breath. Dawn? We still got the grumpy stuff over his head like he's alive. I 
can't get out of here and find clues about Dawn's death. Just around town and gather information about Mabel and Dawn. Anybody ever look something in Mabel's home? This is Agnes. What do you want to know? Devil haha. -ha. I'm going to do mine next. Petey got no respect. You should reconsider. What the devil's name are you talking about? I can't go back now. Okay, well, good luck. Okay, so I'm pretty sure it was her. Oh, this is my house, isn't it? There we go. We find undeniable proof that Mabel killed Don. There must be something here. Okay, we read that before. Oh, there's something wedged between the two books. Got mysterious vial. But the pharmacy can identify the contents. I'm busting myself for the murder. Can I help you? Yes. Yes, I just found like powder. Okay, where'd you get it? The chemist gave it to me. I'll speak to my colleague. One moment, please. Be protein powder and not poison. Please take it back. It's poisotox. Not only is it illegal, it's also very deadly. I could lose my license if the inspectors find this here. While poisotox returned. I'm finding some good proof. Really seems like Mabel poisoned her husband to death. I feel like she didn't. I need to look for clues about Dawn's death. I don't know if there's anything else I can find. Let me try the pub again. Where's Don anyways? He hasn't been in here in weeks. That man's totally dead next. Yeah, I think I'm busted. Okay, I need to think about this. Mabel had a lousy husband. Is that good enough reason to poison him? She really have no other alternative. Whoa! Doubtful. How'd you get here? Doesn't matter. Give me that vial. What vial? Vial of poison tox removed. Hey! Pours the powder into the teapot. She's gone. She poisoned the tea. What should I do now? I 
I... See, here's the thing. Games like this normally have good endings and bad endings and stuff, and I realize it's been over 25 minutes. You know what? I'm going to leave it on a cliffhanger. That's what I'm going to do. So I will see you guys in the next episode of Gray Fox, where we decided for drinking that tea or leaving it alone. Bye!